we lift our hands this morning in honor to God for the tenth day. The number ten is the number of life and death. When you pay your tithe to one tenth, you are taking away debt and you are bringing in life. The number ten is a covenant number. It's a number of a decree. It's a number of turn around. When God step into a matter and then begin to look at it. Biblically, the number 10 is a number of a man. We won't explain that now. It's a number that reveals God's appointment in the covenant. Today you will take life. And everything that sins dying in your life will come alive. Everything that sins dying in your own will come alive. Everything that sins dying in the way you are born it will come alive. You remember God talking about Titan? He said, Your tithe shall be one tenth of all your earnings. It is the portion of the Lord in all your earning. And when you bring in your one tent, I will do three basic things or four basic things. One, I will open the windows of heaven. Two, I will open the doors of heaven. Every house that has a window is expected to have a door. Door talks of a higher opportunity. Window talks of a lesser opportunity. But they are opportunities to our abilities. You begin to yield more. Three. I will chase away the devourers that can bring death. When you pay your tithe. And four. I will make sure that no scarcity of anything is permitted around you in your house. So when I said that the number 10 is a number of life. It's a number that, that God has said, if you obey me, if you obey me, I will bless you. On this 10th day, I am trusting God for the anointing of obedience. I am trusting God for revival that will bring life to where there is death. I am trusting God to take his place in our lives. And I am trusting God that everything short shall be open. In the name of Jesus Christ we pray. Now, God is going to cause a situation that um, will bring joy in every home. Quickly, let us look at the scripture we are going to pray from this morning. Isaiah 22, I read from verse 22. And the key of the house of David. Hallelujah. Allow me to carry my Bible like this. And the key, and the key of the house of David will I lay upon his shoulder. Let's talking about Jesus. And all that shall believe in Jesus. I will put key on your shoulder. Your body will be full of key. Everywhere will be full of doors. Hallelujah. So wherever you turn to, you see door. You start opening the doors. And opportunities and treasure will start flowing. Today your lost key shall be found. In your house, your lost key shall be found. In your assignment, your lost key shall be found. Key is those strategic ideas that are prompted in your spirit by the spirit of Jesus that help you to become an answer and solution to your generation. Those ideas shall be revived in the name of Jesus Christ. So he said, So it shall open. Keys are to open doors, ideas are to open doors. He had to make connection. So he shall open. Remember, the key became he. Hallelujah. When key become he, it's a personified matter. 
is a mystery. Talking about Jesus. So he shall open and none shall shut. And they shall shut and none shall open. Why? When he opens the door, he carries the door away. You don't need key there anymore. The key has to open the door. Everything that has been permanently locked from satanic war never to be opened this morning. The Rakapatuya, the key of the name of Jesus shall be reopening the doors. Amen. This, the door shall be opened. Amen. Destiny door shall be opened. Marita door shall be opened. Family door shall be opened. Her door shall be opened. I feel the move of power of God. I see God enter into a house that has been so crumbled, crumbled by wickedness and witchcraft. And I see the fire that come it with anointing and the power in the name of Jesus combined together. I see a wind of power. And this yoke of stagnation is broken. Amen. I don't know where you are connected to this broken from, but I said the Lord, uh, I said the Lord permeated into your heart, into your life, Amen. into your career. Amen. Your locked doors are open. Your shut doors are open. Amen. Your locked marriage are open. Amen. I don't know who lock it, but who lock it is not important. But the Lord has visited you, Amen. and your doors are open. Amen. And your doors are open. Amen. Your doors are open. Amen. Your healing is coming. Amen. Receive your healing. Amen. Receive your healing. Amen. Receive your healing. Amen. Receive your healing. Amen. You said forgotten, but you are being remembered now. Amen. 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 That's a burden of fear uh, and the heart of your helper. Uh, People are calling you right now. Amen. And signs coming your way now. The doors are open. The doors are open. The doors are open. The doors are open. You shall be sought after Amen. in the name of Jesus. Wow. Wow. That's a, that's a great travel. I don't know how many centers I saw right now. I don't know how many homes I just entered now. With the realm of power. Those things that appear impossible. Written off. I see power. I see the oil of jesus i see the anointing of god breaking through doors opening the doors Amen. opening the doors Amen. taking away card rooms Amen. taking away yokes Amen. taking away burden Amen. taking away wickedness Amen. taking away witchcraft Amen. i declare the liberty of the spirit ah. By the authority in the name of Jesus. Ah, I pretend that my father had not planted in your body ah, and in your heart. Ah, as a man of God on this day, ah, the day of life, ah, where they are decreeing you to die. Ah, I say, receive life. Ah, 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 Blessed be the name of the Lord. Glory. Hey. You will you will you will witness uncommon miracle of open door. Amen. The way it is in my spirit is immediate. It is in the now. Sometimes it is doors you are not expecting. Uh -huh. There's going to be an embarrassing visitation. Hey. You will say, me? How come? And you will say, it is the tenth day anointing. Everywhere you are relevant, the forces and powers are made you ignored. Irrelevant. 
and never remember the veil is lifted for your Amen. life I release anointing of remembrance and connectivity. Amen. I release anointing of burden of your life. Amen. I begin to send men to your life. Amen. I begin to send women to your life. Amen. I begin to bring answers to your life. Amen. In the name of Jesus, Amen. I take away the garment of rejection. Amen. Your husband is coming. 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 Amen. It is now. I take away the garment of rejection in your womb. Amen. Your baby is coming. 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 Amen. Right now. Amen. In the name of Jesus. Amen. I take away the garment of rejection in your ability. Amen. I see your jaw. Amen. I see your contract. Amen. I see your jaw. Amen. I see your contract. Amen. I see your jaw. Amen. I see your contract. Amen. You shall walk up. Amen. You shall make money. Amen. You shall have have You shall meet there. Amen. No more begging to hear. Amen. In the name of Jesus. Amen. I see miracles. Amen. Oh my God. Oh my God. And I will fasten him as a nail in a short place. Substitution. I will explain this shortly. I will fasten him as a nail in a short place. And it shall be for a glorious throne to his father's house. Everywhere they've taken your place. Okay. There's a sharp place appointed for you by God. You won't understand this until we get to verse 25. So you hold on. I will come to you. And they shall hang upon him all the glory of his father's house. I don't know what belongs to you that have been taken away. I don't know what has made you illegitimate. As if you were just an accident. But there's a root concerning you. And there is a connection by destiny on your life. In Christ, the Bible said the glory of all his father has to be upon his shoulder. And to them that receive him, he make an extension of him. So we are going to wear the glory upon our shoulder. The glory of all the house of God. I'll come on away here. Alright. All vessels of small quantity from the vessels of cups, even to all the vessels of flagons. Verse 25. In that day, said the Lord of hosts, shall the nail that is fastened in the short place be removed. Everything occupying where you should occupy. Everything that has been manipulated against you by witchcraft. I can't forget years back in a house, we went there to pray. And as we began to pray with this scripture, verse 25. A frame fell, and within that frame, we are fastening to the wall seven nails or four nails, four nails. And um, we begin to ask questions. We noticed that a witchcraft operation was in that house, and there were a number of four people living in that house, and they have nailed to the wall, physical nail to the wall. Each nail is standing for one of the people living in that house. I have pinned you. You will never make progress. And it was also covered by the picture frame in the parlor. So nobody will see it. They were the same family. You can see how wickedness can operate. And when it happened, when they mandate confession, and we read an anointing of confession, and the lady there confessed that she did it. After that, doors opened for the family. Every witchcraft spell that have been cast on family and pinned the family to the wall, never to rise. Jesus is returning this morning. Amen. He says, I be cut down and fall, and the burden that was upon it shall be cut off. For the Lord has spoken it. The word of God is here to be enforced. What the Lord has spoken, no man can undo. Hallelujah. Amen. I like you to lift up your voice like a thunder. Every witchcraft nail, every witchcraft nail, fasting on my destiny, fasting on my 
destiny causing stagnation and frustration causing stagnation and holy ghost fire holy ghost fire opro 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 lunia kalana opro mo shuka patuda lunia shuka patida iliana na 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 on the wall of your destiny on the wall of your heart on the wall of my heart ay 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 eka patala na na elo bloka patuka ela bloka paluno ala la 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 o shuri ala la 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 elo mana na ka pata lo bloka dia na no ka e pala pata 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 e pala da 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 na ela pata 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 ya o so ko to to ta ya aya ka ta ka ta ka aya ka ta ka ta o ra ba la lu ya na ta ba du ba la ni a ka ba a ra ba na 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 a bre wa sha ba wa a bre wa sha ba wa sa na to ya ba e to ma ha e to ya la e to ma la e to ya ba ra e ma ba ra i cause you by the cause of my god i bring you down i just fire i say fire as a fire ba a shata e kutaba rakata ba ayataba in jesus name we pray mm. Mm. he said in verse 23 and i will fasten him as a nail in a short place then in verse 25 say in that day, said the Lord of hosts, shall the nail that is fastened in the shop place. Everything your family ever depended upon for destiny progress that is antichrist shall be replaced. Amen. That's what he's talking about. Everywhere they have ever gone to consult for power for help. And it's like a nail. Sure, I have power. I can make her. Whatsoever they have relied on. Outside cry that have become a problem now. Whatsoever have been used as a solution yesterday. That have become a problem now. Has expired. Somebody shout Jesus. Jesus. You are the nail on the shop. 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 Every nail. That have harassed my life. Every kingdom. Every kingdom. Every kingdom. Amen. God might have given you the best of ability. And the nail of deception and manipulation come from somewhere and say, Let me see how you can walk. Let me see how you can succeed. Let me see how you can make it. All those dirty languages are anti confident words. The Bible says, and the glory of his father's house shall be placed upon his shoulder. It means that if your father has willed anything to you, you will have it. If God has planted anything in your, in your life and sent you to become something, you will have it. With Christ, you can never be a liability. Come on, are we here? Yes. Then he said, that shone nail, that nail that they said, this thing, nothing can ever spoil it. But they thank God that even the Babalawo and the, the, the magic prayer that did it can die. But our God can never die. Never die. Come on over here. Yes, sir. Everything done that has defied God's appointment on your life, your house, your marriage, as you listen to this broker, as you connect to this altar, I declare, let your torrent in the name of Jesus rise up against them. Amen. 
be fighting. Amen. Let the authority in the name of Jesus rise. Amen. Enter the foundation Amen. where they were door and break them. Amen. Let the authority in the name of Jesus rise. Rise up Amen. and fight for you Amen. and fight for me. Let the authority in the name of Jesus arise. I call them down. Amen. Open your mouth and pray. I call them down. 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 I he said, and the burden that was upon it shall be cut off. The burden. When there's such nail in a short place, it creates burden. And that burden is to distort, to destroy, to frustrate, to hinder. You just carry that burden as, as, a, as a child without God on the earth. Sometimes burden of health. Sometimes burden. Burden of money to meet need. Sometimes burden to pay your rent. Sometimes burden to meet your need. He said the burden shall be called because, because the God we have is all sufficient God. And he blesses his people with all sufficient anointing. This morning, Jesus shall step into your house. Amen. Every burden. Or the shore witchcraft nail and the gothic nail in your house shall be exposed. Amen. The blood of Jesus shall enter your house. Amen. It shall enter your house. Amen. I am speaking it prophetically. Ah. And I speak like a prophet. Hey. And I speak prophetically. Ah. Based on your heart desire, ah, yeah, Jesus shall enter your house. Amen. The nail in your life. Ah, yeah. The nail in your heart. Ah, yeah. The nail in your mind. Ah, yeah. It shall be undone. Amen. It shall be protected. Jesus shall enter. Amen. It shall enter your house. Amen. It shall enter your life. Amen. Your life shall work. Amen. Your marriage shall work. Amen. Your destiny shall work. Amen. In the name of Jesus. Amen. I cut off the border. I cut off the border. I declare salvation. Connect to the broker. Connect to the broker. Lay your hand on the square. Receive fire. Receive your deliverance. Receive fire. Receive your deliverance. Receive your deliverance. The lepers of your war, the lepers of your benefit, the lepers of your tire, the lepers of your mara, the woman who was a rabbit, a rabbit, a rabbit, a rabbit, a And the key of the house of David will I lay upon his shoulder, and it shall open, and no man shall shut. And in that day, said the Lord of hosts, shall the nail that is fastened in the short place be removed, be removed, and be cut down and fall. And the burden, the burden, the crisis. The symptom that he brought shall be destroyed, said the Lord of hosts. Lift your hands now. Lord, I, I come before your throne this morning. I thank you for Isaiah 22, 22 to 25. The living power in this your living world. And I request this morning, let my people you have assigned to me as your priest by partnership, by membership, by friendship, in any form by affiliation and ministry affiliations. Everyone you have assigned under this grace, under this oil, under this voice, under this anointed that have been a victim of witchcraft, 
and wickedness that have been struggling up and down from year to year. Lord, let your destiny receive redemption. Amen. Receive redemption. Amen. Let your marriage receive redemption. Amen. Let your business receive redemption. Amen. Let your career receive redemption. Amen. Let your health receive redemption. Amen. Let your children receive redemption. Amen. Let your legacy receive redemption. Amen. Let everything wickedness and which are done be undone. Amen. We worship you. Thank you, Holy Ghost. The Son will speak to all the prayer requests in the bundle. Let your power and your light shine upon them. Amen. This is our petition. Thank you for answers. Thank you. We receive the glory of all of the house of your kingdom. Amen. Where there have been garment of shame, let there be honor and let there be glory. Amen. Where there have been barrenness, let there be fruitfulness. Amen. Where there have been stagnation, Amen. let there be liberation. Amen. Where there have been forgotten, Amen. let there be remembered. Amen. In the name of Jesus. Amen. Blessed be the name of the Lord. Hallelujah. In Jesus' mighty name we have prayed. Amen. Wow. With your hand to the Lord. I know that God is with us in this meeting. Amen. We've come to the end of this morning broadcast on the 10th day. Tomorrow is the 11th day. And um, that's four days to go after today connect to the evening broadcast we are sorry for some technical situations in the evening services that um, we are overcoming them it's a long service and that um, quite a number of our crew works so sometimes they don't return until the meeting begins so i hope you will understand uh, the standard of our ministry will remain the same by the grace of god we can only improve now, we also want you to know that um, your offering and financial support is necessary to keep us going. We have quite a number of crew committed to this program, fasting and praying, so they need every support to be fine. Connect with us. And again, when you have requests, please send us your request. Send us your request. Make sure that you do not only watch, let us know you are watching. Let us know you are connected to the meeting. Let us also know the area that you think we can help you. We like we've told you we have Bible school too. There are some of them on mission. Some of them also we feel that you can be able to pay your way. So just connect with us. Make your inquiries. A devotional is a very rich one. You can get it online. You can also get it on hard copy. Make inquiries. Let us hear from you. God bless you in Jesus' name. Amen.